Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Taurus. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Taurus. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful temple of yours, Taurus, as it takes care of you, bulls. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages today your guardian angels have for you when it comes to the person here today that is on your mind. Shout out to the beautiful soul tribe. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. I truly hope you all are enjoying the content here just as much as I am, okay? And welcome to the ones that are new here. Don't forget to subscribe. We would love to have you here, part of our soul family as well. Smash that like button, loves, as you all come in. And be sure to adjust your notification bells for when I go live on this platform. Yes, I do go live throughout the week for all zodiac sign readings. Also, energy check-ins for us daily throughout the week. And definitely go live for questions as well if you have a question that you would love to ask Tarot. All of those opportunities are available on my community board. So definitely keep up with the community board and set your bells to be ready for the next upcoming content. All right. So no further do bulls. Let's go ahead and dive in. Let's see about this person today that is on your mind. Okay. Wow, we have the Knight of Cups here, water elements here. Some of you all, this person may be a water sign. Okay, I heard Cancer. All right, so some of y'all, this person may be a Cancerian Taurus, particularly. Others of you all, this could be a Scorpio, your opposite zodiac sign there. Or this here could be a, uh, what is that? Cancer Pisces. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, a Pisces could be very significant as well for me to actually forget about Pisces. <laughs> some of y'all could be exchanging energies with the Pisces here. Now, the Knight of Cups indicates a love offer, or this could be more of an apology or a love offer here from this energy or this water sign here for some of you all. But we're going to clarify that energy. We're going to get more details there. Wow, we have the Sun card to Leo energy particularly as well. Some of y'all, this person here is a Leo. But this card indicates positivity energy here. This is the most positive card in the deck tours. So someone here is definitely looking forward to this new beginning with you. Uh, they are so happy every time they get around your space and your energy. You really make this person feel fulfilled just to be around, just to be wanted and cared for. And wow, I just realized that that's a bull right there. Okay, so that could be very significant. All right, you definitely have someone here that is excited every time they come around you. They think about you. They get excited here. Okay, and so they're definitely looking forward to wanting to offer you a love offer here for some of you all here. Wow. Let's see what the potential outcome in the future. We'll clarify these cards as well. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. This person is not playing around, Taurus, okay? This could also be a fire sign here, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here, all right? But someone definitely wants a new compassionate beginning here with you. The Ace of Wands talks about something that is very passionate, desiring, okay, to have or to be with. Here's this person always desired to be with someone like you. This person feel like they don't hit the fucking jackpot, here with you, Taurus. Okay, let's clarify the Knight of Cups here energy. Wow, this is a beautiful energy that's coming in for you today, Taurus. Definitely, if this is resonating for you, smash that like button, bulls. That'd be very much appreciated. Thank you so much, Taurus. All right, let's clarify the Knight of Cups energy. Let's get more out of this person's feelings towards you. And what do they want to say? What are they going to be coming in here and communicating with you with this Knight of Cups energy here? Spirit guys, thank you so much for the divine insight here. Why do we have the Knight of Cups here? Where are the Knight of Cups here for Taurus? Wow, look at that. We got the Seven of Pentacles. Someone wants to invest in you, Taurus. This is what the conversation is going to be about, is how this person wants to settle down 
uh, build and establish a relationship or a foundation with you, maybe move in together, buy a new home together type of energy is a person here that's coming in here. They're definitely willing to take the pentacles that they have and carry them on in this new relationship or new opportunity here with you. All right. Wow. Let's clarify the song for it to you. Tell me more about the sun card here, please, and thank you. Tell me more about the sun card. Tell me more about the sun card here, please. Tell me more about the sun card. That, again, could be a Leo there. And we also got with the Seven of Pentacles. This could also be an Earth sign like yourself, a Capricorn a Virgo, a Taurus here, or a Leo with the Sun card. Why do we have the Sun card to clarify the Sun card? Wow, the Page of Pentacles. It's like you're getting offers left and right, Taurus, okay? You can have two different offers that's coming in here as well. We got a page of coins energy here. I'm definitely picking up a new person, a new vibe. Someone that you've been knowing or dating for quite some time here that's ready to settle down with you, okay? Again, that can also be a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here. Let's clarify here the Ace of Wands energy here. We got the page of wands here. Again, more fire element. You're about to get some communication here. If you haven't already, some of you have already got communication here from this person here. And then we have the moon cards here. And then we have the king of cups here. Someone here has been feeling this way about you for a long time, Taurus. With that moon card and that king of cups, someone has been having strong feelings for you for a long time. They just didn't open up as, I guess, like, you know, they maybe didn't want to come off feeling weird to you or feeling strange because they had these feelings for you like the way that they did. So they decided here to kind of pull back. They didn't want to be too much overwhelming or in your space here is what I'm picking up as well here. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Let's go ahead and get some energy here with the Raw Tarot Index cards. Let's see how this person feels. Let's see what they want to say in words here, fools. Okay. Oh my goodness, if this is definitely resonating for you, again, smash that like button towards if you would love to book a personal reading to kind of see about um, what the potential outcome for you and this person may be in the future, because I definitely see a long-term commitment here. Okay, for some of y'all, but we could definitely pull the love romance angel deck out here, get some oracle messages from your spirit guides to get more insight and kind of pick point more of a time frame here and just when is this going to be established for you here okay my email details is down below in the description box to book a personal reading bulls all right so this is what this person here has to say wow we got i put you first and I'm telling the truth. So this person really is very adamant about wanting to be honest with you, wanting you to know how they truly feel about you. Because I feel like with their moon card again, this person held back their emotions from you for quite some time. Uh, they maybe didn't want you to feel, you know, like I said, weird about it. This could have been a friend, a long-term friend that you had. And they're just now maybe opening up and stating that they actually want to be more than friends okay for some of you all here okay and they just want you to be honest about this because they've always seen you as a good friendship and it's like now they've always thought about what would it would been like if i would have actually gotten into a relationship or a commitment with Taurus here so this is why they're wanting to put you first i feel like either way that connection and that uh relationship will still remain the same but this is someone that definitely wants to take things to the next level here with you Taurus. okay Wow, dudes. Oh my goodness. Definitely if the message here today has resonated for you. Don't forget to like, subscribe. I definitely look forward to the next reading and I am wishing the best for you and this person. Taurus, I'm so happy for you. I'm so excited. Thank you again for tuning in today, Taurus. If you would love to join the Patreon family, that link is on the homepage. Be sure to set your bells and I look forward to meeting you all during my live streams, all right? Thank you so much, Bulls, and you all enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.